More recently, with consumer, increased consumer interest in their food, more consumers want to know exactly where their food came from. Now, the government is also very interested in this. When there's an outbreak, they need to know where the food came from. And many times, the, the paths that a food takes to get to your grocery store are a bit more complicated than most consumers realize. This is called traceability, the ability to trace products back to their source. But as many brands have found that there is consumer interest in this, many of them have responded by enabling the consumer to learn more about the food. So here on these eggs, we see a note right on the top. Meet the family egg farmer whose hens laid your eggs. Information is inside. You can go to their website. And there's a code on the eggs. And this one has code 244. When you enter that code, it will pop up and show you the farmer whose hens laid these eggs. So some types of products like this watermelon has the opportunity for you to, it says, see where I came from. And there's this website and a number that you can punch in and you can learn more about this particular watermelon. You'll see that on the other watermelons, they have different numbers. So the number is unique to this product and you can ensure that it's not associated with some sort of outbreak or recall, and really just out of curiosity to know where in the world did it come from? Who grew it? It says produce of the USA, where, where in the United States? So you'll find increasingly that things like watermelons, strawberries, some other types of berries do have either a number or the little uh, QR code, the kind of square with a bunch of little dots in it, with your cell phone, a smartphone, you can scan it and get more information about this product. It's kind of neat.